I moved to North Carolina almost wow, 17 years ago. Never lived anywhere in my life this long. And um, but anyway, when when I first when I first arrived here, I stopped at a, at a barbecue place called Smithfield. And um, and and I probably should give a little a little backstory here. So I grew up, as most people did, eating barbecue that is either a, it's sort of a Memphis or a Kansas City style, which is a tomato based. Uh, well, I'm sorry, not an expert on barbecue, so please don't correct me. Or if you want to correct me, that's fine. But, but basically, it's a tomato-based sauce with uh, with some smoky flavor in it, and maybe a little bit of mustard, a little bit of vinegar, that sort of stuff like that. I mean, they're all a little bit different, but it's definitely it's, it's a tomato-based barbecue sauce. And so, so I remember, and and I've had, <laughs> I've had barbecue made at the side of you know little junky place. Uh, on the side of the road in Alabama and uh, Tennessee uh, and just you know just lovely lovely food just really really well done and uh, not temperature wise but quality wise so so I was really I was like I thought okay I'm, I'm moving to the south this would be kind of a nice little uh, I don't even know what the right word is Init not initiation is not the right word but but you know, something to say, okay, I'm coming to the South, gonna live in the South, and uh, so I'm gonna get myself some Southern barbecue. Back to where the story started. So I stop, when I get into North Carolina, uh, I stop at this, this place called Smithfield's. Uh, Smithfield's a chain, it's quite well known here, uh, but it's, it's mostly a, it's, it's a, it's a North Carolina, South Carolina thing, I believe. And uh, so I ordered a barbecue, <laughs> I ordered a barbecue sandwich, I think, and uh, and they brought it to me, and I said, well, because because what I saw, what I was looking at, was basically a pile of pulled pork. Nothing wrong with that, but there was definitely no Nashville, Memphis, or Kansas City style sauce on this on this barbecued pork, and so I thought something had been forgotten or I was supposed to add my own sauce so I went to the counter and I said where is the barbecue sauce and she said well we have Texas Pete if you'd like to add that to it Texas Pete is a, is a hot sauce it's really good um, so I said well no it's not that I just what <laughs> I expected that it'd be like a sauce and uh, so anyway so I tried it and I will say so here's the difference in North Carolina, uh, Eastern North Carolina, uh, the barbecue sauce is a vinegar-based sauce, and so it's clear. And again, I don't know what all the ingredients are that go into it, but it's vinegar, a little, some mustard seed, I think, some some um, uh, red peppers, other things. I, I don't know what goes in it, but the point is though that it's clear, and it's definitely not a, a nice, warm, uh, uh, a a full-bodied tomato based barbecue sauce so anyway so when I first got here I didn't like it I, I, I really thought oh this is this is not how barbecue is supposed to be I will say however after living here for 16 years and really probably living here for a year or two and sort of uh, you know educating my palate as to the, this different flavor I actually would say I probably prefer it now it's really it's really quite quite good and tangy and, uh, and it goes really well with coleslaw. So anyway, okay, so there's my my big barbecue disappointment turned into barbecue satisfaction story. Love you.